Hi peoples, welcome to this channel. I'm really new to this YouTube thing, so please don't expect any insanely good quality content just yet. I'm just trying this out to see if it will work for me, if it'll work for you. And as you already know from the title, I haven't made any videos before and also this is kind of gonna turn into a little minimalist-ish vibe-esque channel, if you say so. Let's get on with the video. So for the sake of starting this YouTube channel, I wanted to do it for a really long time, but I kind of just haven't had the right circumstances and also it's kind of a scary thing, not gonna lie. Having millions of people view videos, well, I don't think millions now, or ever in that sense, but having the possibility of having a million people view a video, that's just insane. Minimalism. I kind of started this journey my whole life, not gonna lie. My grandma was kind of a minimalist, if you would say. She kind of keeps not many things in her house and I'll do a tour of that later if you would like. I was basically raised to have everything clean, tidy, um, you shouldn't own so many things, like we would re have regular declutters and such. So you're probably gonna ask why I'm one to talk about this. Well, why not? Because YouTube is just a growing platform, people are watching it daily. I know I do. I know I wanted to be a part of this. We already know that hearing other people's stories can help us to think more about our own lives and like reassess the situations that we're in because we only learn from experience. That's why the older generation, they always look down upon us because we don't have any experience or anything. But I feel like YouTube is changing that because we're able to see more experienced, wise people without having that experience and only maybe watching a 10 minute video. A little bit about me. I was a national team athlete for 10 years and I'm still kind of in the gymnastics sport, but I'm not doing it anymore. So I retired about a year ago because the environment wasn't just working for me. It was like, if you really want to say so, it was kind of unhealthy and I'll get into that a little bit later in maybe some of my future videos. I just couldn't do it anymore, maybe? Like, I thought, I thought maybe it was just me and stuff like that. I started changing myself. And later on, I realized it was actually the place that I was in, the people who I was surrounded with. And not saying that this is a bad thing necessarily, but for me, myself, personally, I just couldn't be a part of that. I've seen things from being an athlete, so from the inside, and even more so from the inside, being on the actual board of the national team organization, but I've also seen things now from the outside perspective, so I feel like I have an overview of everything and it's helping me to educate the future generations that they don't need to to follow everything society expects them to do because some of the things are really not healthy and you know sports that like view body image as a thing it's not a healthy thing to live with and i feel like you're supposed to do sport for building up your self-esteem and to be honest i feel like the sport kind of peeled away at all the layers of self-esteem that i had if i had any going back to minimalism this is the whole reason why i wanted to make this channel because i didn't know that there was a word for this thing i was kind of just doing these things on my own. So I was decluttering my room. I took stuff with me to travel and I would leave it there for the cleaning ladies and stuff like that. But I didn't know that the whole art of decluttering had its own like word or genre. And I didn't even know that till 
YouTube. And I'm not sure how I came across a video like this, but I'm really glad I did because it feels like people want to be a part of something and I feel like the minimalist community is just, it's opening up something, some doors that people didn't know of before. So people who were called neat freaks before, now they fall into this category and they can associate themselves as a minimalist. Basically what I really wanted to say is minimalism has found this place in my life that I don't think I will ever get rid of. So I'm not sure if we're gonna have any interest in hearing my story, but I don't really mind because I'm just gonna share it for my own transcendence and because we have the ability to now. Everyone can just easily upload a video to YouTube and whether it's valuable to other people, they can decide that. But they can choose to click on it, they can choose to close the video, it's up to you. So if you're still here by this point, thank you for staying with me and um, <laughs> enduring this torture <laughs> for the last couple of minutes of your time. Thanks for being here and I'm not even gonna say if you like this channel, subscribe, because as a minimalist myself, I don't wanna be forcing this upon anyone and I know that I don't like to follow many people, so that's up to you. You can even just watch my videos as they come if you'd like or don't. I'll be here anyway. <laughs>